highlighting seven key priorities. The Premier says his government was on track. These priorities included job creation, economic growth and providing access to quality education. Economic turnaround stemmed from agriculture and small businesses. Agriculture is key in promoting local economic development, ensuring food security and employment creation. We have supported smallholder farmers with agricultural infrastructure inputs and implements, as well as training. Opposition parties were less enthusiastic. So I was coming to hear what the Premier was going to say about the relationship between education and Satu. He said nothing about that, and that is where the real crux of the problem is. We need inspectors in our schools to make sure that Satu teachers and all teachers are in classroom teaching on time. We had thought that he was going to say that there is a feasibility study presently that is happening to check where are the areas that have got a lot of land underground, a lot of um, water underground, so that people that are, have come here, they can know that in their areas there is going to be boreholes that will address the issue of, 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 of water. The ANC is satisfied with what they had. We are quite also happy to get reflection on the progress that has been made on those uh, key catalyst, uh, catalytic projects that we think that will be able to help us to grow the economy, create jobs, fight inequalities, uh, uh, deal with the issues of poverty in our province. Earlier, EFF MPLs were asked to leave the house for not adhering to the dress code. They were dressed in red overalls. The EFF members refused to leave. The speaker has referred the matter to the Ethics Committee. Busisi Wejemsana, SABC News, Bisho.